right, another series. All right, it's a continuation of the episode, I guess. The episode number two. How do you test the MSG box? Well, it's fairly easy. You just have to simulate of how the MSG box works. So I have ignition coil here. I have the power source and I have the MSG box there. Uh, so here you go. This is basically a circuit diagram for basically all of the MSD boxes. So you have a heavy black and heavy red, which is the battery power. It's very important not to fuse any of this or you're going to have a very bad time. Because uh, this thing draws a lot of amps. This is really not designed to be fused. It's just going to blow. Uh, it could be a switch source if you like, but or like a relay. Uh, but it needs to be substantial. I think it draws more like 35 amps uh, peak. Something like that. That's what I heard. I did not confirm. Don't really care. So... Let's not confuse the MSD boxes. So here I have two powers. One power goes to the heavy red. There's one black wire goes to the heavy black. That's the main power to this baby. Then, if you look here, we have a black goes to negative coil. And look, this looks the same as this coil. And orange goes to the coil positive, which is right there. Then you have a switched 12 volts. That basically activates or deactivates this box, which is this white wire, goes there. Now, to test it, you'd be like, oh, you need the ignition to test it. Don't worry about it. So here, this is the last two parts left. You have a white cable and the mag pickup, which is green and violet. Now, it's very simple. If you touch the mag wires together, the green and violet, and just let go, this should activate the box, giving this all connected, I mean, this part connected. So, it works. So that's the way to test it. And it does make this kind of weird noise because it, it's MSD, it's multi-spark discharge. So sparks a lot of times in one shot so the other way you can test it if you have the white cable let me connect let's see if it works the white cable okay we're back i connected the white cable the um, says it's the points or amplified output kind of yellow wire to occur and whatever anyways i connected the Green alligator clip to the white cable. Here it is on this side, and if you temporarily touch and let go from the ground, it should spark as well. And if you touch it a lot of times, it's gonna spark a lot. And you can have a Morse code too. Now I'm just brushing it against. Okay, uh, I'm going to stop here because I'm just dicking around and I have a lot of more to test. So, this one works, it's good. This one is that, so it's not good. But though how much I paid for it, it doesn't really matter. But it's good, it's good stuff. So I have one, two, three, four, five more to test. So I have one bad, one good, five more to go. And I think I have two or three more somewhere else stashed as well, but I don't know what they are, so whatever. Time to move on. Well, thank you for watching. Don't forget, I don't know. If you subscribe, thank you very much. Don't subscribe. Thank you very much. Bye bye.